Hi, I'm Angie, and today I'm making a really simple Dutch apple cake. I've preheated the oven to 350 and I've greased an 11 by 7 cake pan. Let's mix up the dry ingredients first. In this bowl, I've got one and a half cups of all-purpose flour. I'm going to add a tablespoon of baking powder and a half teaspoon of salt. Just mix those up and I'll set that aside. Next, I'm going to cream a half cup of butter with one cup of sugar. I'm going to beat in one egg. And one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. beat in the flour mixture and three quarters of a cup of milk beginning and ending with the flour just like we always do You can see how easy it is to make this cake. So now I'll just spread the batter in my greased pan and I'll smooth that out. Now I've peeled and cored two medium apples and sliced them into eight pieces each and that explains why I have company in the kitchen because anytime there's apples involved he's hanging around. And I'll just arrange these with the pointed side of the apple down. And lastly, I've got a little topping of a quarter cup sugar and one teaspoon of cinnamon. I'll just sprinkle this over top. And I'll bake this at the 350 for about 50 to 60 minutes. So easy, yet really, really good. Okay, I'll pop this in the oven and I'll show it to you when it's done. Okay, it's been about 50 minutes. Mine cooked a little quicker because it's in a glass baking dish. I'm going to serve this with a lemon sauce and I'll be sure to post the recipe on my blog. You can go to my blog at overthekitchencounter.com to get the written recipe for this and the lemon sauce as well. Thanks for watching and I hope you try some really quick and easy Dutch apple cake. It smells really good.